What's up guys, Travis here with Every Single Sunday and BikeBanda.com. We are here in Moab, Utah with Ready to Ride Rentals for an awesome private dirt bike vacation. That's right, this is a private one. Basically, these guys hired Ready to Ride Rentals to come out here, set up a house, bring dirt bikes for them, and they showed up with their rigs and their gear, and we're gonna have a damn good time. So we got... So from our houses that we're staying out here, we got both these places with the pool and everything. Wow, those are some beautiful looking rocks. I've never been over to this side of Moab before. I usually just ride over on the far side, so this is gonna be all new for me. Single day fees. Single day per vehicle, $5. Oh man, we are so lucky to come out and do this kind of stuff. To be able to come out here, beautiful day. It's probably 75, 80 degrees. Let's check. So first trail of the day is gonna be fins and things. They got some sort of, I think it's a stegosaurus on the sign. Maybe that had fins, I don't know. So this trail looks like it's gonna go from dust to dirt. And it's gonna be a whole lot of everything. But this whole area is a bunch of slick rock, so. Option lines are a little harder over here. There is a lot of rubber laid down on these rocks to put these lines on them. So fins and things is a lot of fun. This is a trail you can bring your friends and family on. You can bring a side-by-side -side out here at Jeep, your motorcycle. Pretty much anyone can come and run this trail. Most of it's fairly wide open like this. There's not really any hard spots. And a couple difficult spots do have a bypass. There is one steep uphill out of a left-hand turn, and that's about the only thing you have to worry about. But besides that, this is uh, one of the easier trails here in Moab. There we go. There we go, man. Rocking and rolling, Brent. Getting up it. Nice and chunky through there. Little mini staircase to come down. Oh yeah, it's a good stuff. That's what we like riding. Hell yeah, man, good job. Get a little breather here. All right, looking good, looking good. All right, first little section, quick regroup here with the boys. Let everyone catch their breath a little bit. So, so far this trip, we have gone eight miles since the house. It's about 90 degrees out. And we're about 5,000 feet right now. So, awesome little start to the day here on uh, Fins and Things. Good stuff right there. Oh, 
Uh, did you guys see another group of about eight bikes come by a minute ago? They're right there. <laughs> Just a yes or no is fine. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, good job, man. They're right over there. We got Howie coming through. Bike sounds like it's running better. And Bo running sweep at the moment. Poor bike. All right, you guys have a nice one. Thank you. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> you want to bring it up or down? Uh, I think I'll it around down. You got it? You want me to give you a hand or? I think I'm okay. All right. Just scream like a little girl if you need help. traction for that there we go baby yeah so that little up right there it's out of a left hand turn and uh, that's one of the trickier sections here on fins and things besides that the whole trail for the most part doesn't have anything that's really too difficult a couple little chunky sections a couple downhills uphills but everything is pretty mild for the most part compared to most things out here <laughs> So there you have it guys, that is fins and things. Um, we showed you pretty much all the difficult spots. There's a couple other things mixed in, but nothing nearly that tricky. So if you think you're up for it, I highly recommend this trail. It's a lot of fun. So huge thanks to our good friends at bikebandit.com, your number one supplier for OEM parts and accessories, and also to everyone over at Ready to Ride Rentals for including us on this awesome trip. So check them out at readytoriderentals.com. And uh, if you guys have any questions on this trail or anything else we do, feel free to leave a message in the comments and we'll uh, do our best to get back to you. Thanks for watching. Get out and ride.